is awesome, it's good, it's fast. There's a little bit of bumps you wanna stay away from, it'll slow you down. Eleanor, you saw that. He wasn't going that fast. Three kicks, and he just floated it. Really awesome race, it's gonna it's be a good event. So I went up against Luca in the round of four, I guess, and he crashed out and then just barely squeaked through that round. It was like 1.3 up on me, and I got the 1.5 differential first lap. So I uh, moved on to the final with Kyle Strait, and uh, as we all know, Kyle Strait's pretty good on a bike. He was slalom champion last year at Sea Otter, and uh, one Red Bull ramp, a pretty decorated rider. So I've always looked up to him, and beating him pretty awesome feeling sure. and to uh, not have him crash out in the finals like everyone else I ended up racing it's, it's good to beat him straight up. Congratulations Jill what a great ride this afternoon Jill Kidner national dual solemn champion Rebecca Gardner and Christian Boyer. Here comes Timmy White and he is missing a rear tire. It's okay. Thank you. Thank you. Nothing short of a miracle. And now it's available for everyone. Every kind of music for every kind of taste. fun mountains awesome tracks good always a challenge and uh, yeah I dig it it seems like every race track here is always different every time I've raced and uh, yeah man it's good it's always a challenge as the altitude here is really high and the track the mountains really big so it's always a long track and uh, 
fast and rocky and sandy and it's good though. <laughs> well, obviously it's the premier platform. I mean, we're going to crown the best guy in the country and we took the guy that's sitting uh, number two in the World Cup overall on downhill right now and proved that United States is still a force to be reckoned with. Nico Mullally, who finished second today, is ninth in the World Cup. So uh, we got some top riders in the world. Obviously, Jill Kittner on the women's side is a former world champion in four cross racing and she has also proven to be coming a pretty darn good downhiller as well. She's been dominant on the women's downhill scene for the last few years. Amanda Batty, hands up. This, this race course has been a World Cup course. This is obviously one of the tougher courses in the United States. The fact that it starts so high in elevation and has a reputation for, for being a super fast course, really, really high speeds, really tough, hard sections in the, in the forest, in the rock garden sections. This is a worthy course. And uh, with collegiate national championships having been here the last few years, Gravity Nats having been here the last two years, Angel Fire's on the map. I mean, you can tell by the line and the lift line. I mean, everybody in uh, the Southern Rockies is out here riding this mountain. It looks like the place to be. We're actually going to stay a couple of days now, I think, maybe, and just do some fun runs. And we got here really early this week so we could ride. And uh, the whole mountain's cool for the people that have only ridden the race course. The rest of the trails are, are really amazing. So it's uh, definitely one of my favorite hills to ride. <laughs>